Egyptologists and anthropologists, archaeologists of the Eurocentric persuasion will say that uh, Egypt is in Africa. They had to concede that, but then they still draw the line by saying that uh, they weren't Africans like that. In other words, they weren't dark-skinned people. And of course, this is all part of the great deception. And the reality is that if they give up Egypt, ancient Egypt, ancient Kemet, if they give that up and say that that was a part of black Africa, then they will also have to give up Israel. And that's why they draw the line at Egypt, because if they give up Egypt, they've got to give up Israel. Now, we're going to go over here, and I'm going to show you where Israel sits on the African tectonic plate, which means that Israel is North East Africa. Now, when we look at this map, this is the, this is the Sinai, okay? This is the Red Sea. This is Egypt. This is the Sinai. This is Israel. All right? This is Saudi Arabia over here. Now, if you see this in Hebrew, it says Haluak Africani, the African plate. Here it is right here. Israel is sitting right here. Israel is sitting on the Haluak Africani, which means that Israel is northeast Africa. Uh, without question, we are in northeast Africa. We are landlocked to Egypt, with the exception of the Suez Canal, which was a man-made uh, ditch, a boundary now. Uh, between, in fact, it's not even really a boundary anymore since uh, Egypt has reclaimed the Sinai Peninsula. Uh, but nevertheless, even those of us who are Pan-Africanists in our thinking and Afrocentric, we forget and we leave off that portion of Northeast Africa and, and, and don't want to claim anything beyond that. Europeans classified this area as a Middle East. You know, and then since this is the Middle East, the other question, where the Middle West? Where the middle north and where the middle south? They don't have no geographical terms like that. And the only reason why they use that term, Middle East, because it disconnects the proper connotation that should go with describing this land geographically.